Hey, welcome to Irma's Insights. Today we're going to talk about how to choose a listing agent for your home. Alrighty, let's talk about it. You want to sell your house. How do you choose an agent? There's so many to choose from. So here's my main takeaway. Like the, 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 if there's one thing you listen to, listen to this, you have to 100% trust whoever it is that you hire. There can't be an ounce of doubt. Um, otherwise you're not going to be setting your, yourself up for success. You have to trust that they know what they're doing, that they're capable of selling your home. Um, otherwise there's, I mean, this is usually one of the biggest transactions for most people. So you have to trust them. It's like you have to trust them with your life, basically. Um, and if there isn't trust, there's no way that it's going to end well <laughs> to say to say it as nicely as possible. So, yeah, I think that's a major, major component, um, you know. You can, of course, you want to look at all of the other stuff, like what is their track record? How many homes have they sold? Do they know the market? Um, you know, what are their clients, their past clients saying about them? What are the reviews say? Um, and you also want to look at, OK, well, what services do they offer? What is the commission uh, rate and all of that stuff um, on top of that? Go over their marketing strategy, go over their pre-listing strategy, um, because that's really important. They have to have a system. They have to have some sort of plan, right? Um, and here is the final thing to really like look at communication. How are they going to communicate? I feel like people don't think about this, you know, but it's so important because oftentimes, you know, an agent will present you with, you know, pre-listing and marketing strategies. And they'll say, these are like the hundred things that we do to get your home sold, which is fantastic. But how will you as the homeowner know when those things are being done? You know, they have to have some sort of system to tell you, OK, this is being done. This has been done. This has been done. You know, there also needs to be a system for providing you with feedback from showings because it's so important. You know, there. So communication is really important. How will you? How often will you hear from them? How will you hear from them? How will you know what's going on with your transaction? Okay, so that's kind of it. I mean, there's not a lot, you know, it's mostly about trust. It's mostly about communication and then making sure that they have, you know, a track record and systems in place. That's kind of it. Anyway, if you have any questions, give me a call. I'm happy to help.